Hey guys, welcome to Let's Go Catch Up Snaps. And you know, every time you're going to go out on a boat or something, there's something else that goes on. But anyway, look at here. Started looking at these little drops here. Found out I had the uh, the water separator that was uh, leaking some fuel. Let me show you what I found here. And... Uh, you know, lucky enough, I looked at this beforehand, but uh, I, luckily enough, I looked at it beforehand, but I want you guys to look at this real quick. Look how the fuel separator is. And let me just tell you something. This is not an old fuel separator because when I bring up the bowl, it's not a, uh, a what do you call it? A uh, It's not dirty at all. So the fuel inside the tank is not dirty. But the actual separator, as you can see, I guess some salt water went in there and rusted that out. But anyway, the leak was not from the filter. It was actually from this little knob here that lets you allows you to take out the water. So I'm just going to have to replace this part before I head out. Uh, so maintenance on the boats, guys, is something critical and something you got to be on top of. And sometimes, even though the filter may not look like it's bad, you see what happens okay guys now we have the new bolt and we have the old bolt I don't know what the deal is with this bolt but there it was there was fuel leaking out of it and you guys know that when you deal with fuel and a boat you have issues so we have the new water separator new gasket and the new bolt with the new gasket so we're gonna put it on here screw it on here tighten it up and we're gonna put it on the boat See what happens. Stay tuned. All right, guys. We got the new filter, new gasket, everything in there now. So we should be okay. And also, I lubricated the top there just in case if any water or anything residue gets in there. It will be totally sealed and without any leaks.